<laughs> Somebody thought they was the big bad wolf, okay? They thought they was gonna huff and they was gonna puff and they was gonna blow your house down. For some of y'all, literally, somebody didn't even want you to have a foundation, baby. They didn't want you to be stable. They did not want you to have a foundation. It's given. They're not stable. They don't have a foundation. Out here homeless, going from place to place. Can I stay here? Can I stay there head ass? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> God will truly bless you in front of your enemies. And a lot of y'all, that's what's going on. Okay? It's given. Keep the enemy confused. Seven of Cups, the High Priestess, the Nine of Swords, and Judgment. <laughs> like, I feel like this, some, somebody was doing spell work and all, literally. Not realizing each candle, every time they lit a candle, every time they thought a bad thought, every time they wished you negativity, or whatever the fuck they thought they was doing here, it didn't do nothing but put more burden on them. Like, I'm getting sickness for this person, too. Like, somebody could literally be sick mentally, emotionally, what I have to, physically, shit, spiritually. I don't know. But they going through it. They going through it, honey. Because it was fucking with a high priestess. They was fucking with a high priestess. They can't sleep at night. They can't eat. They can't sleep. Because this is their judgment. Everybody under judgment right now. Like, the life that you going towards is with the, the life that you manifest for yourself at this point for everybody. So, it's just like, they manifested a bunch of bullshit. So busy, worried about you. While you was over, over here setting yourself up for success, they was over there setting themselves up for failure, thinking they were setting you up for failure. But they set a trap for themselves. They didn't, they didn't really set one for you. Like, they did not. Yes, five of pentacles. They stuck in poverty. Like, this person is crying on this car, honey. They crying, honey. King of swords and a six of cups. This is somebody you have history with. This is somebody you could have been dealing with romantically. Um, or you had a long friendship with this individual. Why do they think that this shit was okay, though? <laughs> Three of swords, because they feel like you hurt their feelings. They feel like you hurt them. And it's probably because you chose to cut them off and move forward. Basically, because you chose to cut this individual off and move forward, they chose to wish the worst for you. Okay? They feel like you stabbed them in the heart. So, they was really on some, oh, let me get this person back type of shit. But it's not valid, because you just did what was best for you. You didn't hurt this person intentionally just do things to hurt them like you chose to move on because clearly something got toxic something got stressful there was confusion there was chaos you had to get up out of there you was hurt so you had to save yourself so this person is upset and try to do this black magic or whatever because you chose to get yourself out of the the conflict But the thing is, with the Seven of Wands, they should have been smarter than that because a lot of y'all way too protected. Get in the bed. A lot of y'all way too protected here. Eight of Cups. So protected to the point to where when you was dealing with this person, they also had a level of protection. He was picking up on this person. Karma. And that's why a lot of y'all was going through this chaos and this conflict when you was surrounding yourself with this person. But the moment you decided to walk away from this person, you took your power back. You took your protection back. And they gon' suffer. <laughs> I done took too much of this. That's what I'm hearing. You gonna cry, honey. You gonna pay me in tears, and now that's really what they doing though, for real, low key, y'all. Temperance, okay? So at the end of the day, it's like while you are creating a balance in your life and you getting things together, this person is like literally going through the complete opposite. Because instead of wishing you well when you left their life, they wish the worst. Did some type of spell work for some of y'all, whether they did it themselves, paid for it, was getting readings done, trying to hope, hoping you was suffering, whatever. Like they was doing something. 
and it definitely give divination or spell work for some for for a lot of y'all i know sometimes we think people won't do that but in today's world you gotta think again because motherfuckers out here getting real real crafty real crafty 